Dea is a precision medicine oncology company focused on identifying therapeutics for tumors with a specific biology. We have a comprehensive core capabilities that span target identification, drug discovery, translational biology, and clinical development. The challenges we faced are common among emerging precision medicine biotechnology companies and really generally across all pharma. The tools are getting better, the instruments are gathering more data, the clinical trials are gathering more data, and collectively this has become an informatics challenge that's relatively new to the pharmaceutical industry. But fortunately, we're blessed to have the IT support from that entire industry that's really now converging with the pharmaceutical industry to create new opportunities and uh, across these platforms. In order to solve these challenges, we leaned into out-of-the-box technology. I'm talking about AWS Aurora, glue jobs, catalogs, S3 buckets, and cloud formation templates. We could automate and integrate all of our data in a seamless way across existing programs and easily add more research programs in real time. When I think about the results we've seen in solving these problems with AWS, I think about the time and the money that we're saving. We're effectively reprioritizing our compounds using our Harmony L machine learning engine, which is built on AWS SageMaker. And this helps us reduce the amount of testing that we have to perform on a molecule. It helps us go faster because we're doing less testing so we can test molecules that we haven't gotten to yet. And finally, the ultimate metric is submitting a new investigational new drug application to the FDA. And this is enabling us to do this once per year. When I think about what's next for our business and how is AWS involved, what we plan to do is democratize the process of making a machine learning model and enabling our scientists to become more involved with informatics and decision makers to make these models and work it into their processes. So it won't just be informatics staff making models, we will have everybody be able to make models.